What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Neil. Um, so I'm going to run through the stuff and audio effects I have up on here. So I hope you can hear me well. Um, so let's see. Deep H core. We have just a compressor. I mean, this is just the, a wavetable instrument that Ableton did. So yes, there's effects on there, but I didn't really mess with anything uh, through compressor. Compressor on there. Everything's pretty like all these compressors and stuff. It's basically sidechained from the kick because I really want the kick to stand out. We'll get to that. That's that one's funky. Um, my trap kick bass. Yeah, compressor EQ saturator. So you can see a little bit of the range. Um, saturator to fatten that beast up, which I really like. Um, piano. I don't think there's anything. Yeah, old keys. The filter uh, for filter sweeps. I have it sweeper. Um, Let's see where it is. Boom, right here. And then uh, kick is very cool. I have two compressors on there, a glue compressor with a normal one um, with a saturator and EQ as well. I wanted to kind of make it pop more and cut out those lows. It, otherwise, it becomes really thumpy and muddy. We'll hear it in a second. Um, really fattens up the sound. I think I like what what the, everything here does with the does to the kick. Um, Hi-hats, yeah, everything else pretty much not really anything um, until we get to these awesome wood sounds. So obviously there's no effects, but I have it getting sent to, since I found out, since it was really simple in class, uh, sending it to a, a little bit of a reverb and a little bit of a delay for this other one, or for this one, a little bit of a delay here. I'll let you hear what that sounds like right now. Um, otherwise, yeah, I think that's that completes this assignment. So let's give this a listen for an outro. Thank you, YouTube, a.k.a. Eric. Thank you for watching.